All right, guys, we have breaking news for the Miami Dolphins this morning. Um, before we get into the breaking news, um, I do apologize for getting this video a little bit later. I want time for the upload so that everyone can see. And also, too, I was at work. Um, the That's kind of right. Um, so before we talk about this breaking news, um, there was a signing that happened early in the free agency, two weeks into it. Um, the Dolphins signed this player called Shaquille Barrett from the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. He was that fill-in gap um, um, when when Christian Wilkins was not going to come back. So he, we they brought him in as like a big replacement for the edge guard, which is I thought at that time was a great um, signing. And then they got Calais Campbell and, and other players. And then they and then they had the draft picks with the chop with Chop Robinson to fill that defensive gap. So this was going to be great. Well, well, a couple of days ago, right when training camp started, was going to start, and the season was just about to begin, you know, uh, preseason is going to start relatively soon in a couple of weeks, and he's he signed with the Dolphins back in March. A couple of days ago, he announced his retirement. And that was absolutely shocking. It was absolutely shocking to say the least that he would retire now and uh, not before. If you're going to retire, why don't you just come out and retire then? That's my question. Don't sign with someone and then announce retirement. That's, uh, I don't know. So, arms up, in, arms up in the air like this. I'm like, first off, are you joking? And second of all, it kind of screwed us up with... Now who's gonna who's gonna guard the edge? Who's gonna guard the edge now? And will our money our money be wasted? Is it gonna be a buyout thing? So that's where this breaking news comes in early this morning. Um, the guy who was part of the team already was um uh left the team, didn't sign with anybody else, but now we have an answer. Uh, breaking news. Um. From Adam Schefter, free agent pass rusher Emmanuel Agba, who spent the past four seasons with Miami, is signing a one-year deal worth up to $5 million with the Dolphins. The deal was negotiated by Drew Rosenhaus and Ryan Matha. Yeah, so um, that is the that's literally it, the breaking news. He comes back with the Miami Dolphins to replace uh, Shaquille Barrett. Um Welcome back, Emmanuel Agba. That is incredible for you to come back. I think you were an absolute great defender uh, for the Miami Dolphins, and I'm so I'm so happy that you're back, dude. Um, but yeah, no, that shocking news had led, what led to this from this morning, and we shall see what happens with the Miami Dolphins this season. Um, our of course our big goal is to win a playoff game. Uh, the Super Bowl is a lot to ask for, but if we can win the playoff game, I think I'd be pretty happy. But dude, the the, the defensive depth needs to needs to get on with it, especially when we lost like Christian Wilkins um, and other players. It was, it's just it's a rough. It was a rough one. Offensively, it's been okay, but defensively, it's been pretty rough. So I'm kind of worried with the defense this coming season. But we'll see what happens when the season comes. And, yeah, a lot of expectations coming. Um, and then we also heard that, um, I believe, Tua is holding out in training camp, um, expecting some kind of contract. We'll, we'll, we'll report on that if, that if that ever happens. But he's in good spirits. He's going to practice at some point. But either way, that's, that's a story for another day. So that's going to do it for this one, folks. If you have enjoyed this video, hit the like button, subscribe for content, because Miami Tuesday gets you back. And when it does, keep it right there with the fair team, you deserve fins up. Let's go Dolphins, and I'll see you guys in another video. Good night, everybody.